In this video, we'll be looking at how to download and install Greenfoot. Before we download Greenfoot, we need to decide which version that we actually need. So if you are a student in Wales and you are preparing for GCSE Computer Science or you want to take Computer Science, then you should download version 2.4.2. This is the version that you will be allowed to use for all of your assessments. So you should download that one to be more familiar with it. If you're just downloading Greenfoot because you're interested in it, then you can download the latest version. So step one is to go to the Greenfoot website, which is www.greenfoot.org. When the page loads, you need to click on the software, which is on the left hand side of the screen. If you just want the latest version, you can click on one of these links here. Okay, so if you're using a Windows computer, you click on the Windows link. If you're using a Mac computer, you can click here. If you need version 2.4.2, .2, you should scroll to the bottom of the page and under on old versions, you should click on the old versions of Greenfoot link. This will take you to a new page. Now we need to scroll down to about the middle of the page looking for version 2.4.2. .2. Here it is. Again, there are a number of links here. You need to click on one that matches the operating system of your computer. So if you're using Windows, you should click on one of the Windows links. If you're using Mac OS, you should use uh, one of these Mac OS links. Now I would recommend that you download one of the versions that says it comes with Java bundles. So this one or this one. Okay. This just means that you definitely won't have to download any other software to make Greenfoot work. So I'm on a Mac computer. I would download this one here, uh, but I've actually already downloaded it and it's here in my downloads folder. So what I've downloaded is a zip file and I'll have to unzip it before I can use it. So I will double click on it and Mac will unzip it for me. And now I have a Greenfoot folder and I can delete this zip file now. So here is Greenfoot. I can actually just use it straight from here. I can just double click on this Greenfoot icon, wait a few seconds. I have to tell my computer that it is safe to run because I just downloaded it. And now Greenfoot should load. Okay, and it has. So once Greenfoot is installed, it will look something like this. You'll get a gray window uh, with a world and actor class on the right hand side and if you have that you know that Greenfoot is installed and ready to go. If you want to you can also drag this Greenfoot application into your applications on a Mac so that it is installed uh, like all of the other applications on your computer. So on Windows, you need to double click on the installer and then follow the on-screen instructions, pressing next each time until you get to the end of the install wizard. And you just need to give it a few seconds to finish installing. But once it is done that, it will be installed like any other application on your computer. And we can go to the start menu and search for it. So if I type in Greenfoot, there's my Greenfoot application and I can click on it and it will start running. The first time you run it, you may have to allow it access, but then it should be fine. 